Welcome back to another Modern Masters Vintage Cube draft here on RivalsOfXalon.com. Uh, Welcome back. Nailed it. I think we're taking this Legion Lieutenant and just trying to force the dinosaur, the vampires. How, we, how with that? That seems all right. How about that? How about that? Do you usually open the booster packs or do you hang out? I never... Are you talking about on Magic Online? On Magic Online, I just I use them for future drafts. I just keep drafting. Oh my god, Damov123, thank you so much. That is the most logical thing I've ever heard. Yes, if Vam if if um if Jace ends up being too powerful, you just ban it again. Also, I wanna I wanna see Jace against the Boggles matchup where they're like, I'll play Jace, and you're like, Okay. I'll tag you for 18 next turn. Okay. Can we go to the next game? You know, like you do. I don't think I've ever had a Legion Lieutenant, so this is going to be... You ready? You ready for the good times? Uh, maybe. And now we got this Osworn Vampirino. Or do you like Exultant Sky Marcher better? What does the other one do? This one? Uh, it enters the battlefield tapped, and you may cast it from your graveyard if you gain life this turn. So it just keeps coming back. Mm, two, three flyers better. I agree with you. Sometimes I try to test you, see if you pass those tests. You never do, but sometimes you do. <laughs> you never do, but sometimes you do. Got him. Got him. Did, did you see I got, how I got you? No. Dude, it's weird to think that in the next the next modern event we play in, I'll be playing against Jaces and with Jaces yeah. and Bloodbird Elves. That's like a completely different format now, man. That's such a change. All the gen people can be happy again. All the single gen people? Oh, Impale? You like that, yeah, dude? That's pretty good. I'm going to put it in my pile of cards that I, I have chosen in this, uh, boost, this Magic the Gathering booster draft. Booster draft. Booster draft. You know, remember who that was? No. Wasn't that Sean Potter? Maybe. Okay, good Good talk. Good talk. Who is this friend, family, person? This is Mike B. How do you know about my content if you don't even, if you don't, if you're not familiar with Mike B? That's what I don't understand. I feel like I've been around a while. That's what I mean. Like, yeah. Like, if you watch me on YouTube, you should know Mike. If you watch me on Twitch, you should know Mike. Either way, that is Mike B. He's a good friend. JC, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Even though you were never gone. You were never gone at all. You've been there the whole time. I think it's just Conquistador, right? I don't think this guy's great, right? Nah, he's a harpy. <laughs> good, good. Oh, another one? Oh, and a moment of craving? Oh, I don't know what to do. T3 is better. It doesn't die to a moment of craving. I guess that's, that's fair, and I also see a ton of these. Watch, there'll be one in the next pack. Dang it, there wasn't one. Oh, I like I like Martyr, but I, I do want to... This is like the perfect deck for this guy, too. Yeah, that Menace guy is really good. You think it's better than Martyr? Yeah. This is two vampires, though. I guess. What do you guys think? Martyr or, or Voracious? Every video is who's that guy or where's Mike. That is completely accurate. It's hilariously accurate how that's true. Martyr? No Martyr. Oh, God. Everybody's saying Martyr, bro. It's right. not even close. You're not even close, bro. Look, another one. Look how we're doing. Well, now we could have both cards. Now we just could, no, we could have two Martyrs is what we could have, you I stupid guess. Mitch. Now we just have a bunch of mediocre garbage here. None of these are pirates. None of these do anything for me. I would just take the one one. This one? It attack. It also protect. Not very well. No, I don't. You're right. This is a this is a common were you here when I opened this? No. Ollie, Ollie sent me this, and I was like, that's something right there. Oof. It's so weird, right? That's like a dude that knows things. <laughs> that's like a dude who knows things. I used to fancy myself a dude who knows things. Oh, you fancy, huh? Who, me? Yeah. Yeah, obviously. You didn't know that? 
Where are all the pe where are all the picks being made here? Come on, bring me some bring me some some vamps. Even this is a vampire. Look, there's a vampire in that. A dead one. Is Hunter a dude Hunter a dude who knows his things? Uh we also refer to that as booping. He's a he's a wow. Okay. I wanna be sky marching all day, boy. I wouldn't mind one recover in this deck either, so we can get back this lieutenant. There was that wasn't a recover. That was a that was the one that dealt damage equal to the number of creatures you control. I would have definitely taken recover over this guy. Oh, sky marcher, keep on rolling. Mississippi moon on the keep on shining. This is, yeah, it was a discard spell. That's what it was. It was it was either this. There's a bunch of three mana black cards in this format. There's Recover, there's Dark Inquiry, and there's Gruesome whatever one. I would take the horse. Yeah, the horse is definitely OP. Or regular P. Yeah, see, I'll take this Recover. I also like Cleansing Ray, but I, I think having one Recover is more fun. And we could just get this Cleansing Ray, so that's cool. Oh, give me a Twilight Prophet. I have, I have yet to open a Twilight Prophet. That would be such gas. The card's pretty good. I haven't even, we haven't played it yet. I do like, I, okay, so one of the reasons I took the Sky Marcher over the Craving was because I typically am able to see like three Cravings per draft and it's really, I'm, I'm always constantly shocked by it. So that was more of a uh, a pick based on my own experience rather than me saying that Sky Marcher is better than Craving. Oh, Baffling End seems really good. Oh, Luminous Bonds or Baffling End? I think Luminous Bonds is better. Really? You can target anything. That's true, but this is one cheaper. Yeah, so what? What do you guys think of, what do you guys think of Baffling End versus Luminous Bonds? What's the, what's your opinion here? Oh, Oof, that was loud. Dim bones. They'd be cracking. <laughs> I'm basically a skeleton. Bonds. Bonds. So bonds, 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 bonds. End, 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 end. Bonds. Slightly prefer bonds. What draws a card? None of them draw a card. Yeah, I mean, everyone's saying bonds, so... I mean, well, not, it's, it's actually pretty pretty divided, is what I meant. It's kind of 50-50. I like bonds because it does get rid of everything. Dinosaur Lord. Or, you know... Dinosaur Lord. You know, like, this guy's actually good, but... Yeah. You know, maybe not Lord, but Dinosaur, like... I don't know why I keep saying dinosaur. Vampire Daddy. Oh, my God. I'm like, why am I, why am I saying dinosaur? I think it's because there was a Reggie in there, and I got real excited. I'm going to put Conquistador on the sideboard. In a perfect world, we don't have to play like three Conquistador. Not bad. I mean, it's it's all right. Really? Yeah, it's all right. We just named Vampire? What about a horse? <laughs> I guess that's true. That is an option. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Horse, low Mike. Oh, I like this guy. Oh, this guy's great. Wow. That guy's really good. He's like a he's like a, a a poor man's vampire nighthawk. We have a ton of three drops, but like, they're all good. But this guy's just this guy could be a three three with the a four four with Legion Lieutenant and uh, Radiant Destiny. That's pretty good, right? Why not both? Five five. No, that is that is a five five, right? Because he's a two two, and then he gets oh, a three four, three, four, and then a four okay. four. Come on, man. Come on, man. Stop trying to make horse a thing. It's not it's not a thing. <laughs> Horsum. <laughs> what is that from? Uh, it was from some weird commercial we found out. Someone posted in the chat before. Huh. 
How long ago was that? That had to be like years ago, right? <laughs> oh man, sewer peaches is pretty good. I think the hardest ever laugh was that item video where he dumps a giant can of peaches. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Wasn't that the Keemstar video? The Keemstar content cop? No, that was popcorn. Oh, my bad. I got I got my iDubs food in the sewer videos confused. He has multiple su food in the sewer. Oh, Glorifier is good. That's pretty good. That's real good. Super Lad Man. Welcome to the welcome to the Sultai Brood. Really appreciate it. And Chad, thank you so much for gifting that. You are a good dude. Chad, but I bet How many times are you gonna do that at the restaurant? Uh I think I'll probably get it out of my system before we go to the restaurant, but that's good. It'll probably happen if... Oh, another bond. Look how late this bonds is. I'm not comfortable with that, but I'm comfortable putting it in my pack. Also, these are great. Uh, all three of these enchantments are great for the old Ascend. You got to diversify your luminous bonds. Oh, Duskly's and Gel and a Glorifier. Which one is it, dude? Glorifier gives something a plus one, plus one. It's a, it's a 3 3 that gives a plus one, plus one counter on another vampire. But this guy's just a good two drop that we could probably use more of. Yeah. It's pretty close. Everyone's saying Zealot. One person said, Brian said, Brian said Glorifier, but Brian, Brian, I don't think actually Brian plays Magic. I don't think he knows how the rolls work, so I'm going to just go with two drop. Nothing. Actually nothing. God, every time, man. Why is that a rare? I don't know, dude. Why, it's I so bad. I wouldn't even mind. If this was an uncommon that cost one mana, it would still be borderline playable. Yeah, true. As someone who doesn't play modern at, at all, the format looks like it might be on so balanced that it approaches an imbalance where the randomness of matchups can play a greater role in results. Uh, I actually think that's that's been no, no. I don't think that's I don't think that's wrong. I think that actually actually has been uh, a reasonable assessment of modern for a while now, because there are so many things you can do that sometimes it literally is very matchup dependent. But the format also has a way of rewarding uh, players who are super familiar. This is actually a great pickup late. Uh, who are super familiar with their decks. You know what I mean? So, like, if you play Affinity and you know all the ins and outs, you know the sideboard plan, uh, you know the exact times to attack and when not to attack, like, you will be rewarded for that. What? I don't understand this game. Our deck is insane. It's our three-drop dot deck. It's, it really is, dude. There are a lot of three drops here. Wow, how many dark inquiries can we get on the last on the last wheel? Can our last pick be a dark inquiry instead of a land? Maybe. Nope, just the sea legs. Oh my god, opening a Vana would be utterly insane. I would like. Can you imagine Jace gets unbanned, we open a Rekindling Phoenix, then we open a Vana? Come on. Come on, man. How much better does it get? I'll even splash for a Vraska somehow. A Dantor Vanguard, also pretty sweet. Glorifier of Dusk? It's kind of like a poor man's Vana, I guess. A very poor man. Tip Chargeback, I definitely play Magic the Gathering cards. D doubt it, Brian. Can you prove it? I think it's definitely not this card, right? This card's not great. No, that card's terrible. It's definitely Glorifier, right? Yeah. I mean, I like Skyblade Elite <laughs> as well because it's just a two drop and we need more two drops. And it just becomes better with Radiant Destiny and Legion Lieutenant, but this card's just real good. Man, look at this cutie. Oh, man, look at these dinosaurs. Anointed Deacon, very, very good. We do have some vampires, so that's pretty cool. Anointed Deacon. I like this guy. I think this card is just fine even in our vampire deck, but we don't really need a three drop here, and I wouldn't mind having a deacon, so I'm just going to take the deacon. Oh, look at this guy. Ha! <laughs> oh, boy. This is just Seeker Squire. This card's fine. Why isn't it a vampire? I don't know. I, any creature I see in this format that isn't... a human scout? Who wants a bat imp? Spoiler alert, wizards. That's just a bat. 
they all look like imps, okay? I played in taps all the mana with the cards and the spaghetti. All right, that's, I mean, that's a good point. I didn't consider that, Brian. I take back what I said. You guys like Zeal over Seeker Squire? I really want two drops here, man. Yeah, I like the two drop. Oh, this actually gives plus two, plus two to vampires. All right, whatever. Or uh, first strike to vampires. Yeah, we'll take that. I bet we can find more two drop vamps. Oh, boy. Not good. No, this isn't a great pack. I mean, it's just it's just anointed deacon number two, I think. Yeah. But now we're done with five drops. They're all done. Oh, another conquistador? Really? It's the four mana thing, do you? Uh, it's the cutthroat guy. If it enters battlefield and a creature result damage, you can kill it. That's not bad. It's not bad. Is conquistador better? Where we can just play two conquistadors? Yeah. I feel like you need three for it to matter. So do we want three? No. All right. Oh, old growth dryad. Not not the same as tenderoni dryad. That's for sure. Is Pillar of Origins good in our deck? We just named Vampire? Yeah. I mean, it's better than anything else in this pack, so whatever. Also, we could have had Raptor Hatchling, and we could have had... Our, I think our red-green deck would have been good, and we were kind of going for that, but... Whatever, this guy's fine. We talked about doing a red-green deck because we did a blue deck first. And uh, we were going to do... We were just going to be... That was going to be the Jace Tribute Draft, and this is going to be the Blood Braid Tribute Draft, so... But then we opened the Legion Lieutenant, and it was just like, well... We'll just go with that. If you know what I mean. I don't. Yeah, it was complicated. I understand. Prying Blade? What is that? Is that even good? I would love a Twilight Prophet if they can still... You think I'll still get a Mythic Twilight Prophet? Sure. Is it? Is that still possible, you think? Why not? Keep your fingers crossed, kids. Oh, that's actually... Oh, ooh, we got the options here, boys. I like the one two. Yeah, I like the one two. I mean, I don't want another three drop. Is really what it comes down to. Yeah. And this is a this is a three four. With our with our things. Yeah, we'll just take that guy. I don't hate this card as much as I should. I probably should hate it more, but I'm still gonna take it. It's not good. You're not good. Wow. Look, we got a looming Altasaur for. Uh, wow. What? Wow. You're making... Like... The way you're sounding is really weird, man. Wow. Wow. How many Ascend cards do we have? We only have, like, one Ascend card, right? Just Radiant Destiny? So I'm not really too concerned with Ascend. Oh, we got Dust Charger as well. Yeah, I'm not really terribly concerned with Ascend in this deck. This deck seems... seems like a good deck. They're good decks, Brent. I was actually worried about removal. We have Impale and Double Luminous Bonds, which is actually a good amount. So, I'm okay. Acoustic Sun is stroking out. <laughs> oh, good lord. Sometimes you got it. Oh, we got a Blight Keeper. That's our Bat Imp. A Bimp, if you will. Or an Impat. An Impat. Look. Look at this little cutie. His neck turn is so weird. Neck turn. Whatever. I'm just going to take all the dumb cards now.
you better run, you better do what you... Can a Bronto lick its back? Um, I... Maybe. It feels like that's a thing it could do, right? Look, we got 23 cards exactly here. Actually, this deck looks great. It has everything we want. We have removal. We have some nice sideboard options and like Cleansing Rain, Demystify. And uh, we have a lot of great... A lot of the top end cards in our in our tribe. You better run, you better do what you can. Why is Beat It always stuck in my head? I don't know. <clears throat> Alright, so let's add some lands and then just play the deck. Good deal? That's good. 7, 10. Now we're going 9, 8. Especially with an Impale and... Sesco, thank you so much, man. Six months in a row. Steve Meridian, I'm watching you both. Can you can you not? That's weird. I'd appreciate it if you didn't. I don't think that's appropriate. So. Why can't this be like a vampire pirate? Why couldn't he have snuck on the ship? A vampire. And disguised himself as a pirate. Because he can't hang out during the day. Hmm. It's a good point, actually. I didn't think about that. Um, it would be really good if we had a planes. I agree. I'm gonna keep it anyway though, because we do have this guy, and any white source makes it real good, or or good. White off the top is just the best thing that could ever happen in life outside of unbanning Jace the Mind Sculptor. So I'll take that. That's fine. A little late to the party, but uh... yeah, typical. Typical conquistador is always getting there after everybody else. That was a. Keystone reference. All right, well now we're dead. <laughs> as quickly as the game was started, it was decided. You didn't like my conquistador joke? It was so it was so relevant. It was like so historically accurate. What did you say? I said typical conquistador is getting there before getting there after everyone else. Oh, I got you. Maybe we're not dead. Well, they're gonna do some shenanigans here, so. They're gonna like. They're blue green. What are they gonna do? They got nothing. They did. They go crashing. Oh, that's pretty good, I guess. Okay, I lied. They did a thing. <sighs> oh my god. Why are you the way that you are? That's annoying. That's real annoying. Beat up. What are you saying, Alan? It would make me real happy. What are you saying? Can we play a mountain for what? What you just want to throw a mountain in the deck randomly? You would have donated if I if I donated if I just put a mountain in randomly. What is what is your deal, Alan? What is your deal? Well, there you gonna hunt the week here. If you do, I'm just going to the next game because this is not a, a, a this is not a, a favorable opening here. It's not it's not hard. You just kill it. Yep, there you go. There you go. You figured it out. Nice. He needs the chuckles. Is that what he said? I need the chuckles. <laughs> I need them. <laughs> Give me those chuckles, dude. You're fine. Yeah, four, four, two, one. We take six with nothing to play. Oh my god, really? What is this? What is the deal? What's the deal with this mana base? Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're talking. They went to six two though, so yes, keep you forever. Forever? Forever ever? I'd have been greedy and bottomed it and hoped for a planes. Wow, that is greedy. You're not wrong. Random Mountain High Colorado. Do we play this guy first or this guy? Probably this guy because we just want to hit... Uh, Because we just want to be able to hit the other planes. I was really scared they were going to have like a flash guy for two. I don't know what's going on. Like a river bow or something? Like a rocky mountain high. Oh. That'll do, pig. It's 
pretty good. I will choose Vampire. For you. Here comes Hunt the Week on our Legion Lieutenant, which is going to be sad, but... Well, or they just concede. concede. Either one. These have been some fast games. These have been something, that's for sure. Why does this card cost five mana? I guess it destroys a land. I thought it was actually just the one that when you, whenever you tap it, it deals to. What's that one called? Contaminated Plague or something? Yeah, something like that. Every game, huh? All right. These hands all look very good, too. Like, this hand looks great if we don't mulligan here. Two drop, two drop, three drop, That they all get bigger. All right, let's try it again. Okay, we can finally play the, uh, the Sky Marcher. Oh, that was a great draw. It replaces itself. Oh, look at that. Would you say that Ember is the color of your energy? I would say. Uh, I, I would say, say the Shades of Gold display naturally. What do you think about that? Nothing. Nothing. I don't think anything about it at all. Are you going to hornswoggle me? Don't get swaggled, bro. Uh, only one draw card vamp in the deck. Oh, wow. They just have six there. That's interesting. They went from being able to play something to... Look at this. This is a great curve here. Get some. So now we ha our hand is great. This is a this is a solid a solid game we're playing here. What what do we want to draw here? Pizza. <laughs> oh god, my acoustic son is acting up again, guys. Yep, here comes the old hunt the week because they always have it. Whatever, I'm gonna impale that dude and attack you for a million because. That's how we do. Don't have dive down. Oh, you didn't. All right, cool. What do we want to draw? Pizza. My mama told me I had to stop swoggling my horn. She <laughs> says it's the devil's treasure. Wow. Wow. All right, I guess we're just hoping you don't have a way to get rid of this guy. If two cards in hand. Hunt the Week doesn't do it. Mm, that's real obnoxious, but... I guess we'll just take five here. Actually, we can chump block this guy. That seems pretty fine. Okay. It's actually very good. What do we get here? Lord boy. Actually, this might be better. Deacon might be just better. Plus two, plus oh next turn. Um, Actually, Lord boy is probably doing the same thing, right? Yeah. Sky Marcher could also be good because we have... We, it might be nice to gain some life. True. I'll just go Lord here, I guess. Do we just pay two and, like, attack with both? Um, Give this Vigilance. Maybe? Because they didn't have double, they have double block here, which leaves them with one dude. 
and have one card in hand. Why don't we just float it, guarantee to win next turn? Uh, because we I don't want to die. I guess we have two dudes. Like this guy can't. None of our guys can block this guy, so we're automatically taking two. So then we'd be at four. I feel like we can just attack with this guy and put them to five. And do that next turn. Yeah. Yeah, our board is real good. Jump in the line. Rock your body in time. Okay, I believe you. Well, that was a quick game. Match. Set. Game set match. Game match point set. You guys know what I'm saying. All those things. Hey, man, what did you hope we drew that game? Pizza. Okay. I don't, think we, I don't think we actually drafted any pizza, unfortunately. What a misplay. Oh, this hand is hot fire. I'm going to keep it. I mean, we have to draw another planes, but otherwise I'm okay with it. I hope we draw a two drop and then a planes. Let's do that. And then I hope we draw the other card that's really good in our deck. That's all of them. Got them. What's that like? What's that feeling? Getting wrecked? Is that, is that new to you? Or? It's all right. Okay. Good talk. We did it. Hey. That's pretty good. Good times, good times. Look how aggressive we are. This guy gets first strike? Good lord, man. Another blue-green deck? Come on, blue-green decks. What does this guy do? One, three? Come on. Come on. Always yield to that. I ain't got no time for that. Do you want to trade with my Rappy? I don't think it's worth saving. I think we just play Martyr here. Jay Loot, glad you got to catch me live finally, man. Appreciate it. If you guys don't know that all the videos, all the streams go up on YouTube, so you guys can check them out there at youtube.com slash Frank Lepore. Really? 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 So it's going to be like that. How's it going to be like that? Who do you block? That guy? That little dumpling? I think, again, we're just going to... I think that's fine. You don't want to save it? I think I'd rather have the trick, right? The trick seems really good. I'd rather take out a big creature than save a, a small one. Like, they're already trading. Oh, they don't even want to, see? They don't even value our guy that much. I guess we just pass here, because we can't cast any of these we we don't have four mana or two white mana so glorify our porn pizza sauce you sometimes you gotta get a little, little spaghetti on their head <laughs> wow you're getting in there at 12 you gonna raid did i rig halt no nothing this is very strange good of a flash guy i i feel like even if they do we're fine because we have uh Zeal. We have baked zealy. Some delicious baked zealy. Yeah. I mean, I feel like they do. What? They didn't? They didn't? They don't have that? What's even happening? We're just gonna play Sky Marcher now. All right. They, that can only block flying creatures. They know this, right? No, they don't. <laughs> no, they don't. Uh, 
okay. But okay. Oh, they said whoops. They know what happened. All right, vampires all day. Is that you? Yeah. What are you butting against? What is it? I'm hearing the noise though. What are you hitting? I'm just hitting the chair leg. Okay. Okay, I got you. I'm gonna get some water. Oh yeah, I'll see you later, man. Have a good have a good time. Oh, Radiant Destiny would be gas, because then we also get to keep up Zeal. That guy's pretty good too, actually. Pretty sure we're just gonna play Glorifier, put a counter on this, and get in there. See if this does anything. Now we can attack with everything because we just can. I still think they have the 3 3 that gives like hex proof. Oh, alright, sure. You got it. Deal. They bounced our guy. But, like, it wasn't that great. It was just literally two-mana bounce spell. So, no harm, no foul. Oh, Do you they... all that pizza slice yet? I'm sorry. Not yet, no. I think... I, I feel like we didn't board it in. I, we didn't bring it in. Huh. That's what I'm saying. Here comes a colossal dread mod. You ready? You can tell by how quickly they play a specific land. Like, they, they windmill slam that six mana. That's just going to be like Colossal Dreadmoth for days. Or nothing at all. Or nothing at all. No, uh, post-combat. Post-combat Dreadmoth? Mm hmm PCD Maw? Or not? Pirates, sure. Well, that's pretty good. Oh, they got another thing? Oh, God. Oh, they just drew cards? Oh, that's great. This is great news. Maybe we kill them here. Maybe. And if they don't block this guy, they're dead. They're probably going to block here, which is fine. Do you block here, too? Okay. You just burp? Maybe. You're disgusting. You're a disgusting pig. Oink, I'll, just, oink. I'll just pay you for one more. Oh, I guess I could have revealed Sky Marcher because you know I have it, but it doesn't matter. Like, we're not going to use the mana anyway, so. Maybe you forgot, and then we gain a, 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 a small point there. Jade Bearer. That was your play, huh? Okay. That was interesting. You your three cards. You played a 1-1. One, one. I don't know what to make of that. Maybe they have Flash Dad. Then I would have just played it during my main phase to put a, a counter on it so we can actually profitably block this guy. Oh. I see. Amazing. How this game has spun so far out of control, I do not know. I do not know. So many Flash Dads. <laughs> Literally Flash Dad and Flash Dad. And then they might even have the other Flash Dad. We don't even know. 
So many flash dads. So many cards being drawn. Good lord. Good lord, too. Look how happy this guy is. He's upside down. He is upside he down. You're care. right. Oh, that's unfortunate. Because well, actually, I don't have another Merfolk, so it's not. That's really good. Hey, that's really good. Give me something good. Oh boy. I think that counts. I agree with you. That does indeed count. Put it on this idiot. Hope you don't have pounce, I guess. Thank God this guy doesn't have reach. No pounce, please. Until now. Oh, we did it. Got there. Now oh, another bonds. This deck is great. Great. Destroy a vampire and enchantment. That doesn't seem great. Nope. I guess we just submit. I don't think we have any great sideboard options for this deck. Submit. Uh, changes aren't live on Magic Online until Wednesday, actually. So, so we can't actually play Bloodbraid Elves or or Jace until Wednesday. But if you guys are watching this on YouTube, actually, it'll probably be up on like Thursday. So, I will have already been playing Jason and, and Bloodbraid Elf in Modern, I guess. Some type of way. Is that how you feel? Sometimes. Tell me how you really feel. How come these subs haven't gone up? I know I've got a bunch of subs this this session alone. Some of which were gifted, so I don't know why it's still it hasn't gone up since we started, but if you guys want to sub or follow, both of those things are super appreciated and uh you get to hang out more often. Also, be sure to connect your Discord your Discord and your Twitch accounts. I think the sand is good. Also, after you sub, get a sub sandwich. Yeah, you that's double subs. That's two subs. Sub and sub. I thought that guy behind you was just a frozen part of the overlay. Why would I ever have that? That is such a weird thing to think. Can you still mock up the deck even though you can't play it? Um, Yeah, but I haven't taken a chance to look at it, so I have no idea what I'd even mock up. Uh... Do you ever feel a little bad when you just get these amazing decks and just destroy people? No, because they knew what they they knew what this was. Can Come I get, on, I'm I'm like cross my fingers for it. You ready? Hey, it's your boy Swamp. Now this hand is like absolutely perfect. Oh boy, that's even that's also good. I'll take one. How about that? You took a whole damage? Yeah, I'm a maniac. Kept the Wayfinder? Alright, some kind of way. Finder. Oh, we got Bonds. James Luminous Bonds. James Luminous Bonds. That's his middle name. The name's Bond. James Luminous Bond. <laughs> Why did you tell me your whole name? It's really long and cumbersome. Can't you just say James? Oh, look at that. He drew a little forest. Also, you think a secret agent would be uh, not keen to telling his name to a lot of people. Yeah, you feel like he'd be a little more secret. What do I know about secret agents, though? I don't think it's Bonds here. It might just be Radiant Destiny. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Next turn we go eight. Actually, next turn we can go three drop, two drop, and uh, get the old... You should name Cleric. Okay, that's... Did it say Cleric? Yeah, it's the first choice. Where, where is... Oh, because it's because like we have a Cleric. I think it just chooses... It shows you all the things that are available to you. 
Which makes sense. Some type of way. <laughs> Why are you like this, man? Uh, my I think my usual stream time is pretty much around like 9 p.m. Eastern. So 6 p.m. Pacific. Like that's usually after I get food. Uh, Mike's usually off work, so we we usually stream, he, he usually joins in. Um, sometimes I've been trying to stream more during the day though, so hopefully I can do that. You guys seem to be pretty receptive to it because we got like 300 viewers, so that's pretty cool. But um, yeah, I mean, like just make sure you follow her. and and JC, you sub, so you 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 should be pretty familiar with my usual stream time. If you get like notifications, you can actually kind of determine when I when I go live. It's mostly just a feeling thing. A lot of times I have a hard time committing to like a, oh, it's 10 a.m. I got to start streaming right now. It's, I don't know. It's never ideal. 10 a.m. What's that? What's uh, what's it? What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'll just take seven here. I'm not blocking. I'm a survivor. I'm going to, yeah. Actually, that might be better. It might be Marcher and, and Martyr. Or is it Bonds? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's the thing. Like doing it at 9 p.m. Eastern is, it's pretty rough for Euros because it's like 2 to 3 a.m. there. No, not not 2, I guess. 3 a.m. there. Uh, I would love for if we just use the metric system, not even because I prefer it, but just because I prefer the the consistency of having one universal measuring system. Not in my America. That's rude. Actually, this is probably this is probably you want to put the, all the dudes on the board so we can start blocking their idiots. What are you doing over there? You just messing with your fingers? You clean your fingernails? Yeah. That's cool, man. I like a clean fingernail. Also, Grumpy Snail, thank you so much for the, the cheers, buddy. Really appreciate it. I'm a survivor. Why do I have survivor stuck in my head? <laughs> I have no idea. I don't think anyone sung it, so. I did. Maybe it's because I survived. Did you ever think about that? Um. Well, we'll see. What are we going to see? If you survive. How dare you talk to me like that? I just calls them like I sees them. You don't call anything like anybody sees anything, okay? No. Not not okay. It's not okay. Well, dang it. I want to just play luminous bonds on one of these flyers so we can get in there with these guys, but I really want to put a guy on the board too. Actually, if we if we play Deacon and get in there with Deacon, they have to double block, which is pretty Big good. Deeks. It's also a 4-4. Four, four. Don't hornswoggle me, bro. Don't you dare with your last card. Don't you dare hornswoggle me. I'll never forgive you. Never. Why are you being like this? Triggered. Elk Tears. Organizing an hour hour almond catch draft tonight. Please send me a notification when you're eating hungry how I see you later. Elk Tears, have a good night, buddy. Thank you so much for hanging out and being a, a, a good a force for good in the universe. A force for pizza. A pizza force, if you will. There's two things in the universe, man. There's pizza forces and there's pizza shits. Always be a pizza force. I feel like our board is pretty unbeatable right now unless they top deck Rivers Rebuke and kill us, but you know, outside of that, I feel like we're in good shape. Or the Merfolk that taps all our guys. I think those are our two dodges. Okay, that's not it. That was good, though. Three cards is good. Radiant Destiny is actually unbeatable in this position, I think. Every time I think of an Ona Deacon, I think of uh, Pete Hines. 
otherwise known as DC Deacon, on like all his social media outlets. P. Dines is the VP of Bethesda. It's the only Deacon I know. I think he's also the VP of your heart. <laughs> I think you're right. I'm just going to bonds one of these dudes. How's that sound? Decent. De- Deacon? No. Okay, well, you just try. No. I'm a survivor. I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to... Uh, what's wrong with you? Uh, I'm a survivor. That's what's wrong with me. So nothing. Nothing is wrong with me. And we get Sky Marcher this turn. Oof. Lafof, have a good night, buddy. I will uh, definitely check out this list and we'll probably play it on Wednesday if that's cool for you. Oh, you're going to put this dude on top of my Liberario? Oh, no. Why are you guys talking about blind people walking into conversations? Is this really what you want to... Is this where you're going to be when Jesus comes back? Jesus, come back. You can blame it all on me. Jesus, come back. I was wrong. What's Survivor, the the stream song? Here comes Rivers Buke. Or Tap Our Board. Rivers Buke, Tap Our Board. That's what's going to happen. Oh. Oh, why are you the way that you are? That's a lot of damage. Tell me more, Michael. I think we can block a bunch of it, though. One, two. We have to block four of these guys. Oh, crying out loud. This is no good. Oh, no attack, though. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, they got five dudes? No, they got four, five dudes. Yeah, all right. So we can't, we can't get in there. So what we can do is give this guy a plus so that they have to block. And then we gain some life, which puts us in a, a little better of a position. Unfortunately, if they're at... If they're at five, it'd be much better for us because then we can actually... Uh, we can kill them. Well, they'd have to block here and take three. I guess they still have to do that. No, this guy can't attack. Only this guy attacks. Because if this guy attacks, they block here, they go to they go to one. And then we just lose our better guy. Can't find a better guy. All right, now we're at 16. We have five blockers and they have four attackers. So now we're actually in good shape. Gifted Aetherborn is a vampire. He's a vampire... An Aetherborn vampire, I think? Aetherborn vampire rogue? That seems like too many tribes, though. You're too many tribes. Aetherborn vampire. Okay, not a rogue. They have two cards. Can we win? Pay two for lethal? What does that mean? We're not... It's their turn. It's not our turn. This guy... I just played this guy that turn. Otherwise, I would attack with all my flyers. That's why he's got the little swirl on him. <laughs> oh! Got him! Apparently, this deck is pretty solid. Who knew? We knew. Did we? Hello. Got him. Did you? Yeah, man. What? Explain it to me. <laughs> hey, man, let me ask you something. How did you get me? You know. You know. This is the ultimate Hershey's kiss. Yeah, that's you left that here. That's your trash. You bring a bunch of Hershey's kisses in here. You eat them while we stream, and then you just leave your Hershey's kiss trash in here. Well, I gotta leave some behind. For Look me. at this. Look at this er, this emerical of Hershey Kiss wrappers that he he created. Someone had to. No one no one had to do that. No, they had to. No one did. 
Mike's a survivor. He's gonna work harder. He's gonna work harder, and he's gonna keep working harder. That's the lyrics. Uh, I believe those are the original lyrics. Yes. Hmm. What do you know about R and B? Everything. Frank is thirty-one percent more effective with the mic add-on installed. <laughs> I'm a new reviewer. I didn't see another stream some months ago. I noticed there's always two of you. Who is the other guy? This is my friend Mike. Uh, he just always wants to hang out when we're streaming. So he, you he put just... in the Faf AQ, man. The Faf AQ. The Faf AQ. Okay. The fr frequently asked, frequently asked questions, questions. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. This hand's great. A million, a million times I'll keep this hand. It's a spicy one. It's oh, it's one hell of a meatball, ladies and gentlemen. The only the only bad part is that my oh look an emerald background just popped up. That's funny. My backgrounds randomly rotate every like eight hours. Oh, look at made that. a reservation for six p.m. Oh, that's not good. Why? Because that's too early. Why is that too early? Because I don't get off work till seven. What are your work days? I thought it was Wednesday. That's why it's, it's going to be random. I don't know yet. Okay, uh, Chad, can you make it for like eight? Is eight work for you? Yeah, seven thirty or eight. Chad, can you make it for eight? It should be super easy. I, yeah, imagine if it's Magianos, you did it through Open Table on the website, and that's uh, it's super easy to change those. Plus, it's like eight days away. So, sorry, Chad. I'll know more after tomorrow. Look at this double foul orchard hand. Is it? It's got to be Sky Marcher here, right? Yeah, we play Sky Marcher here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Recover seems real good here. Get back this this spicy gentleman. I don't actually. This is a game I don't actually even care about that thing. Usually I always care about. It. They're just gonna get the jungle barrier protector guy that makes two two nerds. Oh, you're just gonna chain your forerunner of the heralds in there. All right. I'm actually real tempted to just kill this guy. Did I just impale this guy? Attack for four. You can actually glorify or put it on this guy. Yeah, I think that's better. At Tim Myth and Card Guard, I work at a crappy office. What do you do, Mike? <laughs> Out of curiosity, what do you do? What would you say it is you do around here? Around here, nothing. I'm a people person. Also, I can definitely go for some pizza. I'm getting hungry. I'm pretty pretty starved. Well, that's because you woke up at like 3.30 and then... I just impaled this guy, right? I think so. Getting there for a lot. Or is this just... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... We can make it a 4-4, four, four, but then they still, like, get the... They, what did they get? They got this guy? All right. We, ha we have to kill one of them, actually, because otherwise it's going to be too big. Plus, if we draw a land, we can play both of these, which is great. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. If you want to trade here, that's more than fine. Mike is like an old furniture. You get used to it. Wow, that is... <laughs> That's a thing, I guess. Oh, that's pretty good. Aren't you just dead to this guy at a certain point? We can play... Actually, I just play this guy and kill you next turn, right? And rate 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We have 9, so this, this is just vigilant and plus 1, plus 1. I'm down to clown. Oh, the best kind of pizza is free, Tonus. You are correct, buddy. You are correct. What All if right. it's from, like, Domino's? Um, why do, why do you have to be like this? I don't understand. 
Does it give you pleasure to be like this? Yes. Oh, that's sad. Yeah, I don't know why you keep chewing ice on the stream. Every single time, man. Have some respect. I, Have give the, I give the people what they want. Look at this hand, dude. It's pretty good. One drop, two drop, three drop. Four drop, five drop. This this game is this game's already over, man. They went to six on the play too. Oh my god. And we actually have to. Elk Tears was the one. Elk Tears donated money last night for some pizza today or yesterday, so we'll have to get some pizza tonight. We're gonna get some uh, some hungry Howies because that was the. It was like a pizza stipulation where we have to get hungry Howies. So. Yeah, I feel like if we don't get hungry Howies, we're betraying him. I agree. I feel the same way. Well, we can pretty much lose by not hitting our lands, but we did get two more two drops. Or one more two drops. So then we have enough two drops to, like, actually play them, which is nice. But I would like to play bigger things because this guy's probably going to... Another another two drop. All right. Do you block one of these guys? You block here? Oh, you got to block here. Yeah, that seems fine. Come on, lands. Daddy needs his lands. Actually, at Hungry Howie's, we're getting that Detroit style. That's why we get the, uh, you get the burnt crust. I'm like, just give me that, the most burnt crust you have. This feels bad. I feel like you have something here that's going to just blow us out completely. I'm real suspicious of black mana. I just have no desire to attack right now. I'm going to attack with this guy because uh, if you do kill this guy and you block, we still get one one out of it, so. And that's probably what you're going to do. Moment of craving on the Legion Lieutenant. Yep, it's pretty bad. Yeesh. And it was exiled, which is weird. Why Why this exile is a creature, I don't know, but. Like, you have recover in the format. It seems like uh, putting in the graveyard is sufficient enough, but. What do I know? Nothing is the answer. I know nothing. If you get Gumby's pizza, you can also get Pokey Sticks. I have no okay. idea what's happening. Also, you're going to talk about pineapple? You're going to bring pineapple into this chat? Unbelievable. You think you know somebody. And then they get all pineapple-y on you. Like pineapple on pizza? I actually, as far as jets go, I think it's one of the... Oh, that was a good draw. Jets ain't bad. It's a little greasy, but, you know, what who, pizza isn't? Who isn't, though? You know what I mean? I have a lot of grease, Greg. What do you want? You want milky or something? To me. Eh, whatever, man. Whatever. I'm just going to kill this guy. I feel like our board is good. We just need something to push through all this damage. Like, they obviously can't deal with our flyers very well, but we just don't have any flyers right now, so. Jalapenos plus pineapples? That's so weird. Ugh. I don't know why you'd ever put Filipinos on a pizza, to be quite honest. <laughs> Jalapeno children? Yeah, that's weird. That's not appropriate. Vampire? Is that a... Is that just messing around? I can't tell if they're just that, that's just like a joke. Which is pretty weird. It's a weird joke. Here comes the old... The old two-dude dude. Pineapple equals heart. Pizza equals heart. Pineapple pizza equals sad face. 1,000%. You've nailed it. I was in the camp of pineapple pizza. It was okay. But then Gordon Ramsay said it wasn't. So I had to switch sides. I'm sorry. Like he's a Michelin star chef. Yeah, I had to go with his opinion. I defer to the experts. I'm gonna work harder. I'm gonna. Just take six here. Oh, I'm gonna trade, trade, trade. You're gonna trade, trade, trade. Gonna make a trade, trade, trade. Yeah, put whatever you want on your pizza, unless it's gross. Gross. <laughs> 
What's the next pineapple and artichokes? I mean, by artichokes, I meant anchovies. Yeah, I was like, artichokes sound great. Put that on a Mediterranean pizza, brah. All right, we finally hit that land. Do we just play Sanguine McBang McBanger? Or Dusk Chargy McChargerson? Well, we won't be blessed either way. But next turn we will be, right? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, yeah. 7, 8, 9. We'll just play the Charger here. Plus, I'd rather save this in case we have a flyer. <laughs> no, the old human flesh pizza. The classic. Oh, my God. Can we can we have a vote in the chat whether you prefer human flesh or pineapple on your pizza? <laughs> flesh versus pineapple. Go. It's all. It's up to you guys. What's the What's the verdict here? Wow. I wish we had our. I wish this guy wasn't exiled randomly. we still play glorifier here oh god i really want to save it for a flyer though but our horse does become a five five Hanging depends out. on the body part and the preparation of human flesh wow i don't want this to exist anymore why not both Pineapple topped flesh. <laughs> this is how I got banned from Twitch because I talked about eating human flesh on stream. Not me per se, but I, I brought up the topic, I guess. Yeah. And they're like, yeah, this guy can't be on Twitch anymore. I want a flyer or a radiant thing. That's neither. I don't or know. land. Well, that wasn't the worst draw. What do we do with it, though? Actually, we can probably just put it on this guy. And then just get in there. And, like, that we kill whatever they block with, which is nice. And then we can get him back next turn, which is cool. Or next turn we can attack with Glorifier and do the same thing. And then get Glorifier back, which is even better. Uh, let's kill it. Kill it 1-4. I have that 70s song, that 70s show song stuck in my head. I don't know why. Mike is starting to look pretty juicy right now. Whatever that means. I don't know either. I'm uncomfortable by it, though. One floater. One floater is all we're asking for here. I feel like we have a lot. I agree with you. That's, That's good, that'll do. Let's say vampire again. Oh boy, that was that was a juicy, a juicy McMoosey. <laughs> a juicy McMoosey. You heard, you heard. I did. I just don't really know what it means. You know what juicy McMoosey means? Don't even I start do, with me. I don't. I definitely do not. I do not. I could both they go block here block here what else can they do they can go one 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 four in here that seems fine they can go two two three two yeah all these are fine i'll just tag with these two this horse doesn't get vigilance though because he's not he's just a real he's a hard working horse he doesn't like to he doesn't like to rest on his laurels his horse laurels Okay, that's pretty good. I am a fan. And we get a dude back. And we still have the we still have the vampire in hand. Okay. We only have two cards in hand. I'm feeling good about about what we got here. Flyer. <laughs> How about double deacon? That seems good, right? Double deke. The old double deeks. Just 
just put it all on this guy. Our deck seems good. Is this deck good? Seems all right. Hmm. Feels okay. I always like it when I can draft cards like this because now I can use it for the YouTube thumbnail. I can use the Radiant Destiny because when you get a rare, it doesn't happen frequently. So you're always like, yes, that's the unique card I'm going to use. I get that's that's a little thing I get excited about. It's real sad. I feel like we're in. I feel like we're doing pretty good here. It's pretty easy to pick off your opponent's creatures with double anointed deacon and a Radiant Destiny. I think. Is that all it takes? Apparently, that's all it takes to 3-0 your draft. So, that was pretty sweet. Nice. That was nice. We have a bunch of... We have seven and two packs. We got three drafts in the queue. That's pretty sweet. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys for uh, liking and subscribing on YouTube. Smash those buttons. And uh, we'll see you next time.